three. Angel, why are you messing up with your hair? I'm coming, Mom. Get your ass here. Can you come and see my work? I can draw better than that. That is a big lie. You can't even draw. Yes, I can. <clears throat> Fine then. That's what I'll see if you can draw. I'll tell you to, I'll tell you to draw a chair. If you can draw a chair, I want to pinch you. A chair? Yes. <laughs> if you can draw a chair, I want to pinch you. Okay, I want to respond to you. <laughs> That's not true. Do not draw anything. Do not draw. Draw. Draw what? Everything. Okay. Just want to draw something. Okay. Are you guys not done? Can you draw oh, you don't want to eat. Yes. It's a lie. I think oh, you, know. you make mommy's face look terrible. See mommy's face around it. I drink by myself. I drink just now. Oh. I can draw better. You cannot draw better. You draw it worse. That day I told you to draw. Let me draw. Let me draw. Fine. So, yeah. I, let me, what should I draw? Let's do a drawing competition. Mm -hmm. What should I draw? After school. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. But you don't have any drawing school. I mean, last time you messed up everything. I did. You did it all. You did. Admit it. Fine then. Last person inside. Last person to school is a rotten egg. You are a. You are a rotten app. What? All right. I know. That's enough. This one is good. That's it's enough. Sweet. It's enough. Come. Let's wait. Come. Come here. Oh, oh, oh this girl. Oh, you don't want to go to school. I'm taking you with me. Come here. <laughs> little, little, little. <laughs> Come and see that before I break your legs. Okay. Say your baby. No, what? Angel, stop it. I really have a lot to do. Really. You don't need to do too much, you know that. Mm -hmm. I don't want those girls to be too excited seeing you. Mm -hmm. Let them be. Oh, yeah, I'll answer you. <laughs> so, you need to go downstairs. I want to get too late. You know you have to I drop know. your kids at school. Yes. Uh... Do you want me to put this? Oh, no, 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 no. Um, actually, that reminds me. Ihoma called yesterday and said she was invited for a job interview and she needs me to stand in as guarantor. Oh, yes. Yeah. Oh, she told me about it. Mm -hmm. But since I don't have what they're requiring for. Oh, that's the document right there. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, just help Miss Carlington uh, send it to her, okay? Thank you. Thank you, baby. Thank you so much. You know you don't have to thank me for anything, right? She's your sister and that makes her family. Family stands in for family. Can you just accept that you're a good man with good virtue? At least accept a compliment for once. Okay. I'm a good man with good virtue. And I accept the compliment <laughs> for once. <laughs> All right, move it. All right. See you now. All right. <sighs> Come on. <laughs> <laughs> There's no time. You got to go to work. All we have is time. Okay? Time. Hello, my angels. Hi, Daddy. Yeah, my beautiful angel. And my beautiful, <laughs> beautiful, beautiful, beautiful Ada. Mm -hmm. You guys look beautiful. And what do you say when Daddy compliments you? Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome, my angels. Let's do this quickly. Angel, hope you finish your food. Go today. ahead and eat so you can go to school, okay? It's your time. 
しときでいいそれは、ここに。Hello? Good morning, sis. Hi, Yum, how are you? Oh, sis, please, I have an interview and I'm supposed to go there with a the document. Cheta promised to. Um... Yes, yes, yes. He dropped them before leaving for work. Oh, great. Please, can you send them to me? Can you scan them and send it to me? I'll do that. Okay? And send. Have you sent the files? Which one? Ah, I didn't see. You didn't include among the ones you dropped, too. Maybe he forgot it. I'll just um, I'll just search and to get back to you. Just give me a minute, okay? Oh, please hurry up. You know I don't have a printer at home, so I still need to go and look for a way to print it. Print it out. Print it. So why not just keep going and get a print and I'll send it to you before you even get one. All right, that's fine. Thank you.
pictures with this. There is one boy in my class that likes looking for my trouble. I don't know why, but I don't like him. Mommy, I want ice cream. Mommy. Mommy. I'll get your ice cream, okay? Finish up. Okay. I don't know why he likes looking for my trouble. How are the princesses? Sister? Um, okay, so you guys will go have the ice cream. I'll be back, okay? You know me. Don't push me! Why do you have pictures of my younger sister? It's a humor. 
Ioma sends me her new pictures, sends me pictures in, the, in all, all sizes, in all forms, and, and throws herself at me, and I... I... You're a liar! Yuma will never do such! How long? Tita, how long? Let me look up so I'm sorry. It's, 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 it's the devil. How long have you been spying and stalking on my sister, Tita? How long? I've been in love with, with your mom before I met you. I was in love with her. We became friends, and I wanted us to be more than friends, but she, she never looked my way. She never paid attention to me. She said she was in love with that brat. And she introduced me to you, her older sister. Why didn't you just tell her? I did. I tried my best. I, I tried to give her everything now I could. I showed her all the signs, but she couldn't see me. She was not looking my way. She was deeply in love with that... Stanley, Stanley, she was in love with him. And to stay close to her, I left you. I'm sorry. Honestly, I'm sorry. I am, I am deeply, I am deeply sorry, baby. I am. Please. How did you manage to take these pictures? This doesn't matter. It's not the pictures that matter. What does it do? Did you manage to take these pictures? Don't let me! You don't let me do that! You know, every time that she came visiting, I had a car planted in the bathroom and in, in, in her room, and I, I watched her on the laptop. I'm sorry. I am, I am deeply. I swear. I swear. Oh, I swear. Oh, this is my sister. Stop. I thought you loved me, Cheta. You deceived me. You used me. How can you say I used you? I never used you for Christ's sake because I'm married to you. We have kids together. We have kids together. I, I wouldn't have come this far with you if I was using you. Why did you marry me? If you've been upstairs over my sister, why did you ever think of getting married to me? You're a devil! Stop. Stop. Did I help you with this? No! Stop. Stop. No! Stop it! Yes, Sokoki, yes! I'm in love with your sister! I love your sister! But for Christ's sake, I'm married to you! We have kids together! That should count for something! What do you want me to do? I have never cheated on you! Stella, I have never, ever cheated on you! Sure, at least listen to me. Come on. What's so hard? Listen to me at least. You must stay here, okay? And just lie down. Lie down, okay? Just stay, stay, stay in here and don't come out, okay? Maybe. Um, whatever you think you saw, 
What if I think you're sorry to know what happened? What if I think you're sorry to know what happened? You cannot mention this to anyone. No one. You cannot, you cannot say this to anybody, okay? Do you understand me? Mommy is just. Mommy is just. Um, mommy is just. Mommy's just lying down on the floor. She just. She just lay on the floor. She'll be fine. She's going to. She's going to stand up very soon. Then everything is going to be okay. Okay, baby. Huh? Okay. Okay. Let's get this. Let's just lie down. You can lie down and sleep. Stay in here. I'll get your sister to come and come and join you. It's going to be fine. Mommy is going to be fine. She's just, she's just on the floor right now, and she's going to be up very soon. Okay, stay here, no, no more. <laughs> Mom, good evening. Are you back? Yes, I Welcome. am. Welcome. Thank you. How did it go? Well. They said they would get back to me. Let's get back, get back. Let's watch and see. <laughs> Let's watch and see. All right, no. we'll okay. Nice. Now, when did you speak to your sister last? I've been calling her, her number is not true. Mm. He called me today. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. While I was at the interview, I was supposed to call her back. So, you didn't speak to her? Mm -mm. Let me call her back. Please do. Please. Oh, pick up. Ringing and she's not picking. Hey, Papa. Biko, call her again. Call her. Oh, Biko. Hello, Stella. Oh, hi, Cheta. Um, good evening. Please, where's my sister? My mom really wants to talk to her. Um, 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 Stella, come to the phone now. Why? Uh, um, she's... She's what? Give me that. Give me. Give me. Hello? Cheta? Where is my daughter? Why is she not picking her calls? I don't go back and. This is 
Jetta, what happened to my sister? She, she. Eh? Look at the pull down. Oh my God. She fell down. She fell down and she hit her head. She... Okay. Oh, she's dead. You oh, said. Okay. You need to put yourself together. The kids need someone to take good care of them. Are you the only one that can do that right now? Please stop crying. Okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Saturday. I was sure you and the kids were going to be home. Yes, yes. As I came to surprise you uh, all. Yeah, I'm actually surprised <laughs> at the end of the day. Anna. Wow, my baby. My love, I missed you and I came. Here I am. You came back in to surprise us. <laughs> Did you see that? Yes. What about your sister? She's in the room. Has she spoken yet? Oh, yeah, not a word. Poor child. Mm, well, not to worry. The doctor says that she will speak eventually. She just needs to get over the shock. Chat, are you sure? Yeah. Eventually she will speak. I'm so worried. Mommy, my love. <laughs> eh? So she's upstairs, right? Come, darling, let's go see her. Hope you will your own little Orca type, sir. Orca style. Ah, ah, you will see that. Now you're okay, right? Yes, mommy. Okay. Uh, mm, let's go. Be careful, be careful. Tom, honestly, I have missed your cooking. <laughs> Chat, I'm so glad you love the meal. Like this. Ada, don't you like this meal? Would you like me to make something else for you? Pesta or noodles? Tell me whatever you like, Ada, and I'll do it for you. I'll make the food. Mom, I think Ada is not happy right now. Maybe better I'll take some food upstairs for her. Chata, are you sure? Yeah. I mean, she does it from time to time, but she'll be fine. I'm so worried about this girl. For two years, she has not spoken. I'm worried, Chata. Poor child.
Cheta, how are you coping with these two kids and your job? Is it not very stressful? I mean, it's very hard, but I'm managing. It's been two years you lost your wife, and your children are still very young. Why can't you take another wife? You mean I should marry again? Yes. <laughs> I'm sure you, you'll be wondering how come it's coming from your mother-in-law. Mm -hmm. But I'm considering the children, Jetta, and yourself. You need a wife to take care of you, and the children need another mother. Mom, I don't need to marry again. I mean, I can't, I can't even think of allowing a woman come into this house, into my life, into the life of my children. What if she maltreats them? I mean, look at Ada. Ada hasn't said a word in two years. How many people can handle that? But, but Mama, Mama, no buts. There's no buts. Mama, I said, where will I even find a woman that will love these children the way their mother did? The only person in this whole world I can think of is Ihoma. Ihoma is the only person that can love these kids the way their mother did. And, and I, I, it's it's impossible for me to even think of asking her anything like that. I love her like a sister, and I mean, she she's with Stanley. Yeah, um, Yoma, how are you? Hi, are, are you okay? Uh, no, I'm, uh, no, my stomach, uh, my stomach hurts, seriously. What happened? I, I bought, uh, I bought something by the roadside on my way back from work. Cheta, how many times will I tell you not to buy food at the roadside? You know you're allergic to so many things. Oh, and it's late. I, I would have come over. Can you manage to go to the hospital by yourself? No. No, no I, can't, I can't manage going to the hospital. I'm feeling like this now. I, can, I might pass out while driving. Um... Okay, I'll come over with Stanley, so he can check up on you. No, um, no, uh, um, I think I'll be fine. I'll manage it. Are you sure? I mean, Stanley is right here. He can come with me. I said no. It's, look, I, I'll just go and sleep now. Good night. Wow. <sighs> Babe, this your brother-in-law's frequent night calls is becoming something else. And who told you I want to go over there, by the way? Stanley. Hmm? 
You know Jetta just lost his wife. I'm taking care of the kids, his work, everything. The workload is too much on him. So is that why he wants to make you his replacement wife? How? I mean, he calls you every time. He calls you for the slightest things, babe. If he wants to complain or nag or cry or laugh about everything, he calls you. I mean, are you his girlfriend or his wife? <laughs> Wait. Am I sensing some jealousy? Oh, come on. Mm? I'm not jealous. I'm just stating Honey, the obvious. Look, look. Cheta is just like an elder brother to me. Oh. Mm -hmm. And probably he's doing all these things because he feels comfortable with me. Oh, really? Yes. <laughs> I don't think so. That is what you think. Mm -mm -mm. But that's not what he thinks. No. No, you're going to stop being a jealous boyfriend. Right? What are you doing? <laughs> What's your plan? My plan? Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, we'll find out soon. for me. Yes, he got my date. Sit. I hope there is no problem. Whether there will be problem, Ihoma, depends on you. Me? Get called in Aka. Mama, what have I done? It's not about what have you done. It's about what can you do. Kedifi game. to eat your food. Are you okay? Okay. You know I care about you, right? I'll go downstairs and get your food for you so you can eat. And then you take your medicine. Okay? Thing. Why? What is abominable in what I said? Where, where did I go wrong? Where? During my own time, it used to happen. All I said, try and be a mother to your late sister's children. During your time. During your time, Mama. I mean, why would you even come up with such ridiculous idea? And besides, why me? Why? Why you is because you are the only sister to let Stella, your sister. She already had a family before she died. The two children, they need you. Go and be a mother to them. What is so bad about that? No. Think about family first. Mama, eh? this is insane. This is insane. Because no matter how, how I look at it, it makes no sense. Mama, you know I love Stanley. We are engaged and we are about to get married soon. People break up engagements, Ihoma. Do this for your family. Stanley and the children, they need you. Break up the engagement for the sake of your family. 
Ah ah, get the yana, Cody. No. Mama, no. Enough of this. Enough. Enough of what? Eh? Listen, Yoma, wait. I am not saying Stanley is a bad man. But Jetta is equally a good man. And the children need you. Ihoma, think about the family. Consider. Hmm? Mama, you know I have been with Stanley since my university days. How do you expect me to, to leave him and go marry my late sister's husband, Mama? How? I do be an angel's well-being is very important here. Consider them and be a mother to them. Help Cheta. Mama, but they can always come here. Oh, I can go to their house to take care of them. Ihoma is not the same. I don't need to marry Cheta to take care of my, my sister's kids. I said it is not the same. Being an aunt and being a mother, they are two different things. What we are talking about here is to be a mother to the children. Why are you being difficult? Mom, you're just being very selfish. Yes, you're being very, very selfish. If anybody is being selfish in this matter, Ihoma, it is you. It is you who is very ungrateful. Your sister has been so nice to you. Why won't you consider that? You're talking about being selfish. No, me, Look at of, this. Enough of this. Eh? I'm not going to sit here and listen to this discussion. Enough of what? Where are you going to? Ihoma, Ihoma, come back here. Come back here. See this girl. This girl walked out. Let's just watch and see. My grandchildren first before anything. Can you not call that? Oh, my come gonna have to find you're here talking what I don't understand. You're in love. What can I do with that? What name is he? Oh, I don't know. Um, come in. Hi, babe. Hi. Are you alright? Yes, I'm fine. What are my angels watching? Cartoons. Cartoons, can I join you? Okay. <laughs> Ada, how are you? Daddy, Ada never talks to me either. She never talks. Yeah, I know. It's just that, uh, it's just the phase that she has to go through, okay? You said that the last time. This is a long time now. Yes, but she would soon get over this phase and start talking. And she'd be louder than all of us in the house. Right? See? Don't worry, she'll be fine. I'm fine. Did I do anything wrong to you? Stanley, this is not about you. I'm fine. Just go and eat. <sighs> You're really scaring me right now. Whenever you're ready to talk, I'll be right there.
Oh, Jenta. Thank you so much. See all you brought for us. Darling. Mama, it's nothing. It's my responsibility to take care of you. Besides, I... I haven't seen Yoma around. Oh, Yoma. He went out. He went to see this guy. Get the mafia. Stanley. She will soon be back. How are my children? They're, they're fine. They're fine? Yes. But today is Saturday, Cheta. You're here. Who is with my kids? Um, the, the maid is, uh, is taking care of them. Cheta, hi, Mom. Yeah, Ma, how are you? Fine. Cheta, how are you doing? I'm um, fine. That's good. Um, let me freshen up. Where are you going to? Can't you see Cheta is here? <laughs> Cheta, no, 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 please. Sit down. Why is this girl always so nonchalant and insensitive? You couldn't even ask about your nieces. <coughs> How are the kids? Oh, they are fine. And Ada, any word? No, Ada hasn't said a word yet. But um, Angel, she got involved in that. What happened to Angel? What happened to her, please? Is she okay? Mom, it's, it's, it's nothing. It's just that I just didn't want to involve No, you. you have to tell us. What's wrong with Angel? She injured herself while playing. You see? How bad is it? Just a bruise on her elbow and her knee. You see? Ihoma, did you hear that? Go up there now. Pack a few things and get ready to go there and take care of the children. It's very important. Mama. Don't mama me, please. Didn't you hear him? That the child got injured. Or what you want to hear, is it that the child is dead? Or the child has broken, Ma mama. Or she has broken her head? Ma mama, no, it's okay. I'm she, mama, she has healed. It's okay, she doesn't need to come. Cheta, I keep telling you this. There are certain things you should keep off. We're talking about my grandchildren here, please. Allow me to handle this. Iwama, you have to go there and spend a couple of days with them. I want that child to be fine and well taken care of. And that's fine now. Mama, I just don't think we should um, force her if she's not willing to come, you know. So what now? I don't know. I'm just confused. You're confused? Are you kidding me or what? She asked you to marry him. So are you going to break up with me and marry your brother-in-law, or what? Stanley, do you think this is easy for me? I am not saying it's easy for you. But considering what we've been through together and how far we've come, should you be confused? What if I was the one that was confused about our stand? How would you feel? Man has come. That's what you and the society would say. Stanley, just stop. Stop. I haven't even made a decision yet. Did you just hear yourself? Did you just hear yourself? You want me to sit back here and wait for my girlfriend of six years? to tell me if she's going to marry me or not. Is that it? Okay. It's fine. Just sort yourself out, okay?
Then you're not even touching your food. You need to hurry up, okay? My love, how do you feel now? Okay. Better, right? That's good. Good morning, everyone. So, Daddy. Oh, good morning. How are you? Fine. Hello, my angel. How are you, sweetheart? I'm fine. I no mm. longer have fever. Are you sure? Yes. Uh, that's my girl. Uh, you're not going to work today? Uh, no. Uh, I, uh, I just thought I'd you know, stay at home and um, spend some time with you all. You know, have any time? Yay! <laughs> mm. Is that so? You don't want me here? No, I mean, come on. We're going to have so much fun together. Yeah. Right? Yeah. <sighs> How are you? Are you eating your food? Alright, see ya. Alright. Okay, so don't rush your food gently and slow. Hi. Hi. Um, please come, come in. Do you want, do you want something? Um, no. <gasps> Did my mom tell you anything about? About, about what? Um, nothing, nothing. <laughs> Forget it. I want to go and see Stanley. There is something I want to discuss with him. Is everything okay? I mean, with you too? Yes, everything is fine. Okay. I'll be back. You don't have to worry. Uh, I'm not worried. Look, I do understand that the kids love you being here. I mean, I do love and appreciate your being here. But I understand that you have a life to live. And... Why don't you want to get married? I mean, it's been two years. And you have two kids who need a mother figure. That I don't <clears throat> I don't want to expose the kids to to what? Maltreatment. I mean you know what I'm talking about. I don't want I don't want their lives to be affected by my decisions. I it's, it's not easy being single, it's not easy staying like this. It burns me. But I'd rather stay single for the rest of my life. As long as they're safe and happy, I'm okay. No. But you can't remain this way. You need to be happy. I mean, you are... <sighs> Honestly, I... Look, I know that you and mom are worried about me, and but I'm, I'm fine, trust me. And I believe that Stella would want you to be happy. Just the same way she would want you and the children to be happy. Um, I'll be on my way. Thank you. 
Thank you so much. Are you considering it? I'm confused. The children need a mother. I don't need someone who can help her. She needs to talk again. She needs to be herself again. And Angel, she's so young and so excited about life. And you? What do you want? I just want the children to be happy. That's what my sister would have wanted. They are the only thing that reminds me of her. And you're going to throw everything we have away? No. No, I didn't say that. Stan, I just want you to understand. Me. What do you want me to understand? Have you even asked Cheta what he really wants? Oh, of course he would want the same. Because he won't stop calling you every night. to calm down, okay? You know what? I'm not going to pretend like I'm comfortable having this conversation. Your mother wants this. Cheta obviously wants this. And from the look of things, you want this too. No. No, Stan. No. Do what you want, okay? Stan. going somewhere? Oh yes, uh, I'm going to see your mom. She called and said she wanted to discuss with me. My mom? Yeah. Uh, don't worry, she's... Don't worry, she's fine. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Do you want me to come with you? No, no, I'll be fine. Let me just uh, go and see her and talk with her. Okay? All right. Just take care of the kids. Oh. Bye, Daddy. Come here, my love. Okay. Take care. I'll see you soon. All right. Take care. So let's continue. Chet, I am not done talking yet. Mom, you have said enough. I can mean, What have I said that is wrong? I can't. I cannot. Mom, what? apart from the fact that she is Stella's younger sister, I see her as my own kid sister. Mom, you know I respect you. I respect you enough. And I have never refused you of anything before. But this one, I cannot and I won't. Cheta, I understand that. But you know you need a wife. Your children need a mother. What do you want me to do? How do we go about this? You have to understand that. Let Ihuama come in there as your wife. So that you focus in your job and the children will have a mother. 
Cheta, please. I am doing this for the children. It is not easy convincing your ma. But she's going to come around. All I need is for you to key into this plan. Oh, this, is, this is too much for me. How? Cheta, your children are still young. My son, please listen to me. These children are still young. You are working. The children are there without motherly love. Ihuama is there to help. Listen to me. Okay, what if I, even if I decide to agree to this? Mm -hmm. Woman has a fiance, Stanley is there. Please! I don't want to hear Stanley or whatever you call his name. I'm talking about something important concerning my grandchildren. You're bringing up somebody that has engaged my daughter for the past how many years? For how long now? No bright price, nothing. Why can't we focus more on the important thing? Which are my children? My grandchildren, please. Please, Jetta, please. Personally, I I feel Yoma has her life ahead of her. I mean, what if she doesn't even agree to all these things we're saying? Leave my daughter to me. It is my duty to convince her. Focus and get involved in it. Leave my daughter. She will get a husband, a good man at that. You will get a wife. Focus in your job. The children will get their mother. A motherly care will be there for them. Let us allow things to work well. We have one family. We are supposed to look out for one another. This is the time to test it. Cheta, listen, please. Just promise me you will think about this. It's very important to me, please. Um, I'll think about it. Hey, if we're gonna have a good day, you see, I'm laughing now. To me, you just arrived. Let me now go and organize the Rishi Rishi. Hey, please come in. Oh, this is. Now I. I'll try to stand. Okay. Um, look, Ioma. You know I have the deepest respect for you. I respect you so much. And you and I were friends before I met your sister. And that friendship has grew into family. I guess my mom has told you already. But you don't have to do what you really don't want to do. Do you? I mean, it's what my mom wants. But is it what you want? I told her that I'll think about it. But look, Yomai, this is completely your call. You have the final say. I mean, I, I, I know that she wants us to do this for the kids and it is going to benefit them, yes. But, I mean, Stanley, I'm sure you're confused right now. I love Stanley. I know. And that's why I said it's totally and completely wrong. 
Yes, the children's happiness matters and she actually just thinks that we should throw away our happiness just because of the children's happiness. It matters. The children's happiness matters most. I think I owe my sister that. To make sure her kids are safe and happy. You really don't have to do this. I don't know yet. I still need to think about it. Good night. think fast because I've waited for this for so long you belong here with me I can't wait to hold you in my arms honey I'm going to squeeze you you come to give me the wedding date. Stan. Listen, I, I understand. I get it. You're already confused. You're thinking about it already. You're weighing your options and considering the possibilities. And that's enough reason for me to understand that you never held this relationship in high regard. What are you even saying? What? Maybe you should go ahead and do what they want. Are you breaking up with me? I see that's not why you're here in the first place. Okay. Why have you come? I guess I made it so easy for you. Can you at least hear me out? You know I love you. Stan, I love you. I love you. And I've loved just you for the past six years. This is hard for me as it is for everyone. I don't want to do it. I don't. But on one hand is my mother, and then on the other is the children. Do what your heart tells you to do. My heart is in conflict right now. And do what makes you happy. My happiness lies at the happiness of those children. I am their mother. I am like their mother. And no one can love them the way I do. Absolutely no one. I guess you have your answer now. Do you hate me? No. I don't hate you. It's just difficult for me to understand how it was so easy for you to dump me. Oh. I 
ਦੀ ਫੱਤੀ ਇਟਸ ਓਕੇ ਅਸ ਲੋਂਗ ਐਸ ਇਟ ਮੇਕਸ ਯੂ ਹੈਪੀ ਐਕਸਕਿਊਜ਼ ਮੀ Um hey. your your foot is on the dining. Okay, thank you. Yeah. Um I noticed you don't like wearing your ring. I mean, your wedding ring. Oh, it's um it's not like that. You know, it keeps coming off. You know the last time I told you it's not really my size. I forgot. I will take it for resizing and uh, later. Okay. All right. Hello, Stanley. When will you stop calling me? Not until you agree for us to meet. Why? You're married. I know. I know, but... Please, let's just meet. L -l -l Listen, Yohama. I think we need to respect the relationship we both have now. Stanley, I am not asking to come back into your life. I just think the way we parted... wasn't good. Look, I just need for us to see just this once. Please. Um, please I need to go now. I'm trying to make um lunch. My mom is coming over. Please. Bye. S Stan. S Hello? Who is that? Oh, it's... It's Stanley. I think he's still angry with me. He doesn't want us to see. I just want to talk to him, but... I don't think he wants to see me anymore. I think Stanley's a very good person. Maybe he's just trying to create some space. You are the best. I think too much space. I'll take the kids to the mall. See.
What? 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 What, Chetan? Look, look, Chetan, Chetan. You and I know the only reason I got married to you is because of the children. You need to understand that it will take a while for me to feel something for you. Look, so just go to bed, okay? I'm tired. Please. Problem. Look, I already told you that the only don't, reason don't, I don't tell me that you married me because of the kids. Don't tell me that. I've heard it over and over again. I'm tired of hearing it. You are, you are my wife now. I've been married to you for the past three months. Three months, I haven't touched you, I haven't felt you, nothing. I'm a human being for Christ's sake. What is this? Because my wife, you have a wife to do this to perform, okay? I need to feel you, I need to touch you, I need to go inside you. I need to enter you. I need to touch you. Chitana. What is wrong with that? That's enough. That's enough. Cheta, I said that's enough. Let, let me go. I said that's enough. Can you slap me? I want to apologize for last night. I've been trying to apologize. I'm sorry. Mom called earlier. She wanted to know when we'll be bringing the kids to see her. Cheta, I know you're still upset. I know you're still angry with me. Shouldn't I be? No, shouldn't I be upset? Guillaume, we've been married for the past three months now. Three good months we've been married. Emma, do you think I'm a toy? 
What do you take me for? Do you think I don't have blood running in my veins? Or I don't have feelings? You expect me to, to lie down there with you on the bed and act like you do not exist? What am I supposed to do? Give us a try. Give this thing that we have going on a meaning. Let us try at least. Look, I know that you had to compromise on things, on a lot of things, the things that you love, to be with, with us. And every time I look at you, just I just feel like you're only in this because of Stella's death. Look, Yoma, I understand that you had to compromise your happiness for us. But at least, let me make you feel good. Let me make you feel like a wife. Not the kid's mom. Yoma, let me come in. Allow me a space in your heart. Let me, give me a try. Give me a chance. Please. You want to shower with me? Hmm? Maybe we could start from there. Yes, I mean... Yeah, yeah yes. I'll be there. Has the doctor told you when Ada's next appointment will be? Yeah, Friday. Daddy, will Ada go to the hospital? Yes, ma'am. Will she ever talk again? Yeah, she will talk when she's ready to talk. Right for that? Okay. Okay, try and finish your food up so you can do the next Okay. What do you do? Okay. It's all okay. You guys can go to school, alright? Okay. A ghost. Oh, no. Ah, she's here. Yeah. I'll just took us to walk around the neighborhood and uh, miss me already. <laughs> hmm? <laughs> um, excuse me, I need to use the toilet. Oh. Mm. Alright. <laughs>
Honey, I have to run. I have a very important meeting by 8 a.m. I have to go now, okay? You're right. These are blood splashes. Whose could it be? I don't know. Really, look, it seems it has been there for so long. Yes. But is there a way for you to determine whose blood it is? Oh, yes. There's a way. I'll run some tests and I'll let you know. All right. Thank you. Oh, aren't you curious why he has this picture of you in the first place? It bothers me a lot. It does. But I... I can't remember taking such pictures. I would have said it... It could be my sister. But... I can't remember. Maybe you should ask him. He's your husband. But we need to know whose blood it is. I have my guess, but I hope I'm wrong. You think it's your sister's? We found my sister dead in the bathroom. And I found this under the bed with blood stains on, on it. Could he have lied? I don't know, but I find it hard to believe. Cheta is a good guy, and my sister was happy being with him. And you? Are you happy being with him? among her things that were boxed up after her death. It can be used in comparing DNAs, right? Yeah, you, you did well. Okay. Ah, I have to go. I mean, it's almost time for me to pick the kids from school. Oh, it's okay. Once the test result is out, I will contact you. And if it turns out to be hers, we'll find him and make him pay. Listen, I am not doing this because I want to establish contact with you or talk about us. Alright? Let's just focus on why you're here. And if that man is lying about your sister's death, I'll see him get punished. For lying or from taking me away from you. Both. I'm sorry. Sorry for everything. It's okay. It's fine.
Hello? The test result is out, and the blood sample is still us. Wait, what are you even saying? Um, are you alone? Yes. Ihoma, we need to see. What? What do you mean by the blood? The blood is Stella's blood. That is why I said we need to see. Okay? I think you should speak to a lawyer. What? There's a possibility Chata lied to all of us. And if that is the case, that means he's hiding the truth. She was in the bathroom. He said she fell in the bathroom. She fell and we found her in the bathroom. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Okay, I would I would come around tomorrow, okay? I have to go now. I don't want him to meet me here. Um, it was a bit cranky this morning. I don't know. Bye. Okay. my sister. No barrister. He loved my sister. He can't kill her. Yes. Well, that could also be an accident. But for the fact that he tried to cover it up, if we are going to nail him, then we all need proof. So, how are we going to get that? No. No! Cheta can kill my sister. Yeah, Don't you down, get okay? it? Just calm down. Just like the barrister said, all we need is proof. That's all. Right? Maybe he did it, but he's definitely hiding something. And we are going to find out one way or another. And even to ask, was there anyone around on the day she was murdered? The day she died? Well, he said uh, the children were downstairs when he returned. And they didn't see anything? No. He said she slept in the bathroom when they were having dinner downstairs. It's hard to believe. <sighs> she has been making this drawing for some years now, but we never bothered to read any meaning to it. Are you saying that she witnessed it? I think so. Maybe that's why she hasn't spoken since then. And we were thinking she just probably misses more. It's possible. She was probably traumatized from the shock and went numb. 
Or some, you know. Or what? Or someone doesn't want her to say anything. What do you think is capable of doing such? I don't know. I don't know. It's just speculation. Mm. But let's say Ada actually witnessed it. Then this is the proof we need to nail him. Her testimony. Well, Ada can't speak. Then we'll find a way to make her speak. But... Ehoma, Chetha is responsible for Stella's death. Don't you think he deserves to be punished? You know, to my mother, he's a perfect gentleman. He can never do wrong. <laughs> Trust me, there's a whole lot hidden in his smile. <sighs> Let's just hope our suspicions are not true. But then, what if they are? Don't you want Stella to get justice? Enjoy each your food, okay? Hey, sweetie. Uh, how come yeah. Ada didn't join us for breakfast? Oh, she's not feeling too well. So no, I don't think she'll be able to go to school today. Mm -hmm. Um, what's wrong with her? I don't know, I just realized she has fever this morning. Fever? Yeah. So I will take her to the hospital. Oh, no, 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 no. Uh, no. I'm um, just, uh, I think it's the mosquitoes. Just um, get her malaria drugs from the pharmacy. Okay, she'll be fine. Isn't that self medication? No, no, it's okay. Just get her malaria drugs. Um, we'll observe for like one or two days, and if it persists, then we can. I'll personally take her to the doctor, okay? And uh, since I, since she's not going to school, can you just stay back with her? I will drop the angel in school. Okay. Thanks. Um, let me check up on her. Yeah. Ada, tell me, is this the medicine your dad gives you? What is it? <sighs> this is the reason she hasn't recovered. Although the medication is not the cause of her shock, but it will prevent her from getting better. More like trying to suppress her memories or event. What? Yes. This is a very serious crime, and he's doing it to a minor. I knew that guy was a very, very big crook. I can't, I can't, I can't believe this. I can't. Listen, it's okay. You need to calm down, okay? This is not the time for you to be weak. Just put yourself together. At least we know what we're up against right now. So what do we do now? We need to stop her from taking this medication without making each other suspicious. I'll switch the medicine with a reversal effect. And then we'll monitor her and see how far it goes. Alright. This is unbelievable. Unbelievable. I mean this this is it's not making sense to me. Why would Cheta want to harm his daughter? Why? It's okay. It's okay. Hmm? At least for now, we don't know the whole truth. 
Let's not just conclude, okay? What I need you to do right now is take her down home and make sure you keep that safe. Alright? And make sure she takes the drugs I'm going to give you without alerting Chata. Okay? And do it cool. She's much better. Coming to bed. So. Ada, oh, there you are. There's food downstairs, okay? So when you're done with what you're doing, you come downstairs and eat. Okay. Did you just say something? Ada, did you just say something? Did you just speak? Ada, did you speak? Say it again. What did you say? Huh? Did you say something? Oh. I guess I was imagining things. When you're done, just come down and eat, okay? Okay. I heard that. I heard it! I heard it! You said okay! You said okay! And then you just spoke! You said something! Oh my goodness, come here! I love you! You just spoke! You just spoke! Yes! I'm so happy! Thank you! Thank you! Thank you so much for talking, okay? But I don't want you to let daddy know. Okay? I want it to be your surprise. Promise me you're not going to tell daddy. You won't, right? So happy, come oh, You spoke. Thank you.
Mom, how was school today? I don't want you to have for lunch. I know you can talk ahead, you. Daddy, have you forgotten? Forgotten what? Ada does not talk. She's not talking yet. But I thought I heard her laughing out loud. Yeah, <laughs> I was just joking with her. Yeah. Okay. I must have had it wrongly then. Maybe the laughter was from TV. I want you to look straight into the camera and tell us everything you saw on the day of the incident. Look, you don't have to be scared, okay? Daddy is not here anymore to hurt you. You are here with me now. Just tell us what you know, okay? You don't have to be scared, all right? I'm scared. Shh. No, darling. You don't have to be scared. Hmm? Nothing would happen to you, okay? Nothing. I promise you, nothing would happen to you. All right? You can do this, right? That's my girl. She ready? Mom was arguing. Mom was arguing with him. She was sitting in his chest and crying, and there were pictures scattered everywhere. And then he pushed her, and she fell to the ground. And she feels a lot of pain. He had a lot of pain. Yes, I am, but is that Stanley? Are you okay? Is there any problem? Are you Mr. Chetago? Yes, I am. You are under arrest for the murder of late Stelago. Um, no, look, that, that, I'm sure there's a mistake somewhere. <laughs> there's a mistake somewhere. Late Mrs. Um, Stella Ago is my, my 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 late wife. She died by accident in this house, and I, I, I really? didn't kill my wife. Really? Well, go to the court and tell the judge that. Yuma. Oh, please! You think I didn't know? You think I didn't know you killed my sister? Now I know why you couldn't take a simple no. 
Now I know why. You, I don't, you, you don't know what you're talking about, okay? You have no evidence to this. There's no proof to this, okay? What, 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 what are you talking about? Huh? You, 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 look, there's no proof to this. You have no evidence. You're just grasping on straws. Mr. Man, we have enough evidence and eyewitness. Among other charges, are the illegal use of drugs on a minor. Yes. And that told us everything that happened. Officer, she's lying. She's lying. What are you even saying? I don't hear my daughter cannot speak. She's just spoken in, 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 in a while now. Are you mad or something? Huh? You're mad? Is this why you married me? To, 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 to... Yes! And then something good came out of the marriage. Officer. Cheta, I will make sure I get justice for my sister. I'll make sure of that. Officer. Officer, are you listening? Look, this woman here, something is wrong with her somewhere. Okay, she's lying. Look, my daughter here. Watch her. My daughter here cannot speak. She has not spoken in the past two years. She has not even uttered a word. She cannot speak. So how on earth can she speak? Daddy is lying. You pushed her. You know what? Officers, please take this man away from me. I am moving. Man. moving. Is... Take him away! Is... Move. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Move. Past now. Never knew this guy could behave like this. I never knew he could do this kind of thing. But to me, what have I done? Awabo. Alice, the good thing is that you forced me to marry him. If not, how would we have known that he killed Stella? I guess everything will happen for a reason. Mommy, it's okay. Alright, stop crying. It's okay. Stanley, I'm so sorry. I offended you. Oh, no, no, Mom. Come on, don't do that. You, you don't need to apologize to me. I mean, everything happened so he can be exposed. So at the end of the day, you didn't do me no wrong. Okay? Stop crying. It's okay, all right? See my granddaughter. Oh, Mom. I'm so, so sorry. Eh, Mom. I never knew you were going through all this. I never knew I could have helped you, Mom. Please forgive me. Hi. Oh. I know Stella will be happy and can finally rest because we gave her the justice she deserved. I'm sorry for everything. Yes, I know a lot has happened and I'm truly sorry. I understand. 